about 153,000 people die every day. I wonder how many of them were consistent apple eaters. Although it is widely suggested that an apple a day keeps you away from the doctor. Don't bank on it. The notion is built on falsehood, just like quicksand waiting to drown all your hope. But then, if an apple-eating culture does not totally guarantee your staying alive, what will? Someone? <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Wait. So, are you really ready for this hike? Cause you were just shocked. <laughs> Duro, you almost got me killed with your incessant sex thing. But here you are, alive and well. <laughs> Wanna try? Yes. Are you sure you are ready for tonight? Your health is getting worse. What about you? Like last two weeks? I can do this. So relax. You know, you know. Duro, please. I can do this. About 153,000 people worldwide die every day. You know enough of your death statistics. It doesn't matter. <sighs> Duro, what if we do this? And if, if it is unsuccessful, we could have a joint breakdown next week. Aha! Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know what? I think we should mark this with an event. Like? You know, something memorable. Mm. Something we can remember. Maybe carve our names in the tree. Or something, you know. Sex.
ba 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 eshu ba ba eshu ba ba awa du ba father in jesus name Amen. father we thank you for everything you have done for this family oh yes we thank you for all you have done for us thank you father, father. thank you we thank you for today we thank you for yesterday we thank you for everything you have done father we thank you lord we thank you for today we thank you for your provision of food Kiloshele what's happening Lord what is it about 133000 people worldwide die every day you know enough of your death statistics doesn't matter okay fine you sure your dad keeps it at the top of the shelf Yes. Okay, fine. Prozac, an antidepressant drug. Is administered orally. One to two doses heightens your mood. Three to four doses helps with restlessness and give symptoms of depression. Five to six can be used to end your pain. Perfect. I hope we are clear with our part. Yes, we are, boss. All I ever wanted was you I'll never get to heaven Cause I don't know how Let's raise a glass Or two To all the things I've lost for you Oh Tell me how they lost for you My doctor. Hello, everyone. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Welcome to today's meeting. Thank you, doctor. So, from the last meeting, we got complaints from some of our patients pertaining to depression. We believe this is due to the types of drugs they take. And we have come up with activities to balance this effect. So, the nurses, together with our resource department, came up with the idea of hosting exercise activities during our support group meetings. Every second Sunday of the month, our patients, their families, and our residential hospital staff will indulge in simple aerobic exercises to keep the heart healthy, just within the compound. It doesn't have to be very intense, just simple exercises as shown in this video. Exercise materials like skipping ropes, gym mats, and dumbbells will be provided to this effect. Hope we understand. Yes, doctor. All right, that's good. According to Duro's psychological prediction, three in every five support meetings we have always get interrupted by one long pathetic outburst from a participant. According to statistics, you are more likely to be killed at a dance party than while taking part in a mini heist, especially one that is domesticated. Imagine all heists led to death. Most kids will be dead from merely stealing from the meat pot. Weeks of scheming and two previous botch attempts resulted into tonight's master plan. The master plan to steal the pill of death itself. About 153,000 people worldwide die every day 
almost 3,700 of these people die from road accidents. To die without intent seems belittling to me. It is the best way to humble a conscious creature. It is ironical that all our conscious decisions based on intent will lead to a simple mishap. What is wrong with you? Hmm? What is the problem? <sighs> Ma, I think it's my health. I think I'm not feeling too well. You, yeah. I'm not feeling too well. Oh. Hmm? What, is, what is the problem? What is... I think it's my breath. I, I can't breathe fire. <sighs> Uh, let's go to the parlor where there's fresh air. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry, 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 sorry. There comes a time okay. when the suffering from a life threatening illness becomes a routine. A painful routine we are now tired of. A painful routine that we have decided to release our loved ones from. Imagine the endless cycle of treatment, trial drugs, doctor's appointments, and grief finally comes to an end and ceases to exist. We thank you for everything you have done. Father, we thank you. Lord, we thank you for today. We thank you for your provision of food. Mommy, mommy, mommy. Kilo Shele. Kilo Shele, what's happening? Lord, what is this? One way, one way, one way, one way, one way, one way, one God, one way, one way, one way, one one way, 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 Please, 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 Left-handedness commonly results to unclear handwriting. Most doctors are ambidextrous with 12% completely left-handed. About 7,000 people die every day from prescriptions badly written by some doctors. Who is to be blamed? What is to be blamed? Can we tell which hand is most reassuring? Death is contrasting. It is neither good or evil. There are loopholes in morality, and even if you run away from all risk-related vices, it is very possible to die from goodwill.
dead people way more. And if you win 